Hi guys, it's uh, John Duffy again, uh, backstage at the Steve Harvey Show. And today we've been talking about empty nest syndrome, when you send your last kids, your youngest, off to college. And some people have asked me, well, what if I have a senior in high school and I've just got that year? Is there anything you recommend that I do with that time? And there's a couple of different things. First off, you want to begin to allow them more and more independence in thinking. In other words, instead of mandating all the rules that you've held on to for their entire lives, maybe decide, let them decide when your curfew is, what, what you're going to do in terms of going to that party or staying in and studying, and stop mandating every element, keeping in mind that a year from now, they're going to be making all these decisions. So you want them to get some practice while you are readily available right there as a guide and consultant. The more you let that time pass, the less likely they are to use you as that guide. So that's the first thing, is you want to give them some rope so that you can create something like a college-like atmosphere where they're far more independent than they were junior year or sophomore year or freshman year. The other thing you want to do is enjoy your connection with them, right? You want to set kind of a groundwork so that you feel connected on an ongoing basis. And that doesn't mean hovering and helicoptering and being on them all the time. That means taking the occasional moment and just saying, hey, I really love you. I'm really proud of you. I'm gonna miss you next year, but I know it's the right thing to do. Take those moments, make the most of them, let your kids know you honor them, you love them, and you have nothing but faith in their ability to manage their future. That will pay off dividends going forward, and they will not forget it. They might not repeat it, they might not thank you for it in real time, but they will not forget it. Thanks so much, hope to see you next time.